Yeah, we should definitely- look at this! <laughs> you could tell where all my runs have ended today. <laughs> yeah, we definitely need to come up with a plan. I think, uh, definitely once the, uh... I don't know if we should make plans before or after the schedule is out. And Rez will only be a stay for two nights. Hmm. Well, I guess you'll be waiting until the uh, schedule comes out. Why do I always split that? God damn. The uh, final game list comes out on Tuesday. The schedule... <laughs> May? Something like that? Dude, my, the only reason why my runs have been ending is because I forget to get Yoshi. <laughs> because I've been doing no Star World races lately, and you don't get Yoshi in that. Guys, you know it's amazing? I only have one week classes left. And then I can start streaming, like, all the time. It's gonna be amazing. I need to pick out a week that I want to do a, like, stream marathon. Because I totally want to do that. Is this route called 96? Because it's the opposite of 69? Yes. Precisely. Welcome back, Satwick. You haven't missed anything. <laughs> What do you think is the coolest thing you could do in Super Mario World with arbitrary code? Uh... <laughs> I, you'd have to let me think about that one. Because... The answer is you could probably do anything. <laughs> like... Of course, you've probably seen the tests where... Like, they made Pong and Snake, and then they did Super Mario Brothers. So you could literally do anything. <laughs> Okay, I came up with this idea. This needs to become a real thing. Where is Master June? Where's P4 plus 2? Where is all those people? So there's a Yoshi's Island arbitrary code execution that was found. Um, that Carl Sagan just did <laughs> for Credit Warp just like an hour ago. And there's an arbitrary code execution credit swap in Super Mario World as well. There needs to be a infinite loop task that just like in okay, it starts with Super Mario World. You use arbitrary code execution to code Yoshi's Island into the game, and then you play that, and then you run that game and do arbitrary code execution to load Super Mario World into the game. And you just keep doing it back and forth. That would be amazing. That's probably... That's the answer to your question, Max. What's the most amazing thing you can do with Ace? Just loop back and forth between two games. <laughs> what is my favorite way to die in this game? Um... Corner clipping. Corner clipping is fun. Uh, like, anything where Mario gets smashed into a wall. Corner clipping, smash all, uh, all that fun stuff. Dude, I'm not gonna be able to do that. I mean, I could. It would take me forever. I have P4 on Skype. I could mention it to him, see if he's up to it. He's probably busy with, like, the other stuff they're planning for AGDQ. Uh, next year. Wait a little longer before starting input on Sheldon. I need to practice it again. I went a long time without, without like practicing it a bunch. So 
Is it possible? Hell yeah, it's possible. <laughs> The only problem I could see is... Actually, you know what? It would probably have to start with Yoshi's Island and then go to Super Mario World. Now that I'm thinking about it. Uh, Yoshi's Island has Super FX chip in it, and it would need that. So you can't start with Super Mario World because it doesn't have Super FX on it. Can't find Super Mario Brothers in Super Mario World tasks. Uh... Just look up on YouTube, like, Taskbot, EGDQ 2015. Rip. I tried. Should do that on the marathon week. No, the marathon week is going to be, like, pretty much probably all 96 exit or no cape, no star world. Is that the video brands? There you go. There's the link. Someone should make a program where you upload code and it makes an ace test because it's totally possible. <laughs> it would look pretty much the same. All you'd have to do is put in controller inputs differently. P-switch Ferris wheel? What is that? Should've gotten a Super Mario Bros. 1 speedrun and speedrun it. That would've been a good idea. I think they were, they were planning on having a task of it, but it was like desynced or something, which sucks. Why did I do that? That's just a waste of time. <laughs> Pokemon Play Switch. That was pretty cool. See, so I know the guy who was working on that, and he told me about the Super Mario Brothers 1 in Super Mario World, like, a whole, like, five months before HDQ or whatever. So I knew that was gonna happen. I had no idea that they were gonna do that next, though. <laughs> so that pretty much blew my mind. Uh-oh. I walked off that edge. I knew it. Lunch piece switches by a wall and they push you and die. I've seen that. I didn't know it was called a P-Switch Ferris wheel. Six p Six p <laughs> That's a lot of P-Switch jumps in the river. That's... fly right away. Can someone remind me not to forget Yoshi in Donut Plains 4? Can't get six Yoshi bounces? Yoshi bounces are easy. <laughs> what is my record? Like 61 or something? Zero time loss. I must be really consistent at that level. Which one was it? Oh, Donut Plains. That was weird, because I'm not really consistent at that level. I can die six times this game. That's impressive, Katie. Alright, well, I have one level left to go, guys. Oops, I forgot to split again. Look how terrible I am. I did one bingo race where I didn't need to split ever, and then now I'm forgetting to split all the time. Do 
263. All right. Thank you guys. I will not forget Yoshi. A jinx. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I'm gonna run, I'm gonna PB in this. I'm gonna be like, where the hell am I? All right, I won't forget Yoshi. Don't hit me, hammer guy. Got him. We're good, guys. Still have to get the star because I'm a scrub. I was looking up low percent strats because I want to do that. This level, I thought this level was like so fucking hard to do because the ending is bullshit. Um, I watched like the world record by Dram and it is really easy. <laughs> Well, hey, I have Yoshi this time. Shit, son, that's the first time I've done that. Dude, this is gold split for sure, <laughs> even though I fucked up the beginning. <clears throat> that is the literally the first time I've done that. Do a run where wherever you beat a level or world that has food in the title, you have to eat that food. So let's see, you'd have to have donuts, you'd have to have soda. I already have soda. A cookie? Just a plain stick of butter? <laughs> vanilla? I don't know what you'd use for vanilla. You wouldn't want to eat plain vanilla. Like, that would be nasty. Oh yeah. I only saved three seconds, are you kidding me? Oh, that's segment though. Thanks, Brams. That is like the first time I've ever done that. So it was pretty cool. I tried to grab them. I don't grab them most of the time. Dude, no, not ice cream. I hate ice cream. Look at all that time I just saved. All foods. <laughs> I could do like vanilla pudding or something. Chocolate. For Chocolate Island. What the hell? That was so weird. <laughs> Dude, that was like the god vanilla dome. Those would have been great wings if I would have just fucking grabbed them with Yoshi's tongue. You don't have to jump up to the second floor to grab them. It's just that, like... <laughs> I never try to go for it because most of the time, yump, <laughs> Yoshi or Mario hit the red block. Um, most of the time, I dupe the block like up and to the right, so I can't even reach the wings because they're too high. That time, I duped it to the side, so I tried to eat the wings, but like I've never practiced it that way, so I fucked it up. Just drink the vanilla. That's like. Dude, if I get, like, a little tiny bit of vanilla on my fingers, like, if you're making cookies or something, and, like, I lick it, it's so nasty. Oh, fuck, I got P-Speed there. I've never done that before. Nice. Sticky fly? 
Yeah! Whee! Dude, I think I've got Sticky Fly three times in a row now. How did they do it? Hold on, I'm gonna read other chat. Okay. How did they do that task? So, there's code in the game, and the processor is supposed to execute the code or whatever. But you can also tell it to, like, read the controller register as code. And so, if you, like, input a little, like, <laughs> what is it? Oh, fuck. Alright. If you input, I forget what it, how many bytes exactly. I think you have like eight, four, two, maybe it's two, maybe it's four. I don't know. So many. You can only have like so many bytes at a time, but you can tell the, the game to pretty much execute those two bytes as code for every frame. <laughs> And so, you can just basically write your own code by but pushing buttons on the controller. But it's like, really, really, really quick because you have to do a different button press, button combination every frame. And that's how- they basically just fed in the entire ROM image of Super Mario Brothers in by the controller. Dude, if I get this... Nope. Nope. I practiced this for like an hour and I couldn't get it. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> Dude. That was the, like, sketchiest beginning of that level ever. <laughs> hey, Pi. Nice name. Dude, don't hit the fucking shell! Don't hit the fucking shell! I also practiced this for an hour and I couldn't get it. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I didn't even try it. That was a terrible attempt. Physics and textures? Yes, everything fed in through the controllers. Graphics, physics, textures, everything. That's all code. Rip fire flower. <laughs> that was on accident. This is for you, Brams. See if I get it. Yeah. 16! Highlight material? I, I don't know. If I remember. What? <laughs> Oh man, that will bill. Would I rather be teleported into a room filled with water? Or a room filled with lava? Or a room filled with lions? That haven't eaten in eight years. Uh, lava, definitely. I would rather die instantly than drown or get mauled to death. Alright, Satwick. See you later. Wait, the lions haven't eaten in eight years? Well, then probably the lions. <laughs> Rams, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, that was kind of shitty. But it still worked. I have a setup for there. Whoa, hey, stop. That, like, Magic Koopa will always spawn in the same spot, and I can just spin jump on her right there. I'm surprised that actually worked, because I fucked it up pretty badly. You know, the reason why I picked the lava first is because I didn't even read the eight years part. I was just like, lions who haven't eaten in... Oh, I'm not gonna make that. Who haven't eaten in blah, and I was like, oh, I know where this is going. I didn't even pay attention. Oh, 
trust this. It is true, Dirt Plank. There's nothing that said that the, uh... That you'd come out at some point. Eat the deadlines. Well, it's limited. Like, you're gonna run out of lions to eat. <laughs> How much did I gold buy in VD3 anyway? Dude, <laughs> Sub-129, some of the best now. Is that fight totally random? Pretty much, yeah. For where... Uh, Lemmy spawns. Oh, hey! <laughs> I was pressing right, and apparently you have to press up there. Yeah, Pi, exactly. some of best puts yours to shame. Well, that's because I split every level. So I get like... Do I even need Yoshi? No. Um... Like, my resolution is smaller, so... I'm not gonna explain what I mean, but you get the point. <laughs> um, and also, like, every split is has like a room for error. So like... Maybe one split I accidentally split too early, and eventually it builds up for all the splits. And since I have 96 splits, say I split like a half second early on all of them, that's a lot of extra fake time that I really can't get. name or a name from 2500 years ago. I'd rather have my mom's name because my mom's name can be both a boy's and a girl's name. The most accurate way to time is with one split. Exactly. But that's boring. <laughs> and the point of splits is like, actually, you know what? I want this. Dude, this doesn't matter because I'm going to feed this to Yoshi anyway. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> The point of splits is to be able to, like, see how far along you are in a run, and it helps to, like, see what level you need to improve on if you go back and look at them. That's also why I split every level. Dude, that worked out. I accidentally hit that wall, but that guy didn't spawn. Not fall in this hole here. Is there there's a way to program the split to read the game memory and split right there? Yeah, you could. Oh, that's a question. Yes. However, I'd need to somehow connect... Okay, apparently I have a feather now. <laughs> I should've just fucking did that. Um, I need some way to connect the console to my computer, which would be kind of difficult. <laughs> yeah, you can go under that level. All water levels have, like, a bit that don't have... 
don't have land and you can just swim underneath. Gold slit? I don't know how. <laughs> Split on every button stroke. The problem with that is, like, it's inconsistent. The button strokes aren't going to be the same every time. Oh, res, you missed it. I think... Maybe you were there. Maybe you weren't. Mark fell in the resi hole during one of our races. Dirt playing that'd be easy, you just have a split and every split would be one sixtieth of a second. <laughs> dangerous way to fly through the level. How is that dangerous? If anything I think it'd be safe. Good. Bonk the red blocks. Oh, Star World 4. Never mind. I thought you were talking about Star World 5. <laughs> I was like, how is that How is that dangerous? I go above. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean, Brams. I get scared at that part. Those were kind of dumb zips. They were okay. Those were good. Satwick, I noticed you. <laughs> Welcome back. <gasps> Two sixty one material right here. What is the better Star World Four strat? time. <laughs> hey, slow bromance. How's it going? Two ninety. Oh, Star World One. I was going to say, 290 isn't that impressive. <laughs> I'd go for 291. Yoshi, don't fall in the water. Okay. Good. I'm doing pretty good. Oh shit, I'm losing time here. Just doing some uh, 96 exit. Apparently I'm like four minutes ahead. Do I remember how to do this? There we go. <laughs> that works. <laughs> Whatever works. 
Feathers! That probably lags his game. Whatever, it's fine. Dude, I was practicing Special World earlier today. I fucking wrecked Mondo. Also, apparently, like, I try it for Gnarly Wings sometimes, and apparently it, like, wastes so much time because I suck at it. So, I'm not gonna do that anymore. Except I'm not so good at that the ending part of the level because I'm not used to going through it. saves eight seconds if all first tries oops see that's the problem i don't get all first try thanks j1 i <laughs> dude i'm like wrecking it tonight do i have a goal time to aim in this category sub 130 ultimately that would be pretty cool Dude, all the gold splits. <laughs> I also practice this. You can triple above grab. They have to be springboards, though. Fuck. I needed that. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, I'll take this then. Fuck. Rex, please. I just need to get peace speed here. Fuck. <laughs> Welp. Dude, please. Rip this. I'm just gonna fucking say goodbye to Blue Yoshi. Ugh. Oh my god, that was stupid. Alright, I'm wasting a little time here. I forgot where the, uh, where the shell I needed to eat was. What? Did I try to do you mean swerp rainbow shell? No, I know I can't do that. So I tried to grab another shell. But I forgot. Oh, fuck. <laughs> that was almost really cool. <laughs> what am I missing about subbing? Okay. Thank you, Max, for the subscription on YouTube. And I guess that's what everybody else is talking about. Because I was like, what the hell are they talking about? Subscriptions. I don't even have a sub button. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> I don't have an extra cape, so this is gonna suck. So I didn't get to wreck Mondo. Dang it. So that was a pretty- well, I guess I'm not done with Special World, but those are the hard levels. <laughs> Next two are really easy. That, that was an okay Special World. It would have been amazing if I didn't fuck up awesome, but whatever. Gold split Mondo, anyway. 
Oh. Well, shit. I'm terrible at reading chat, apparently. Use ace to increase the sprite limit and make it rain piece switches. I guess technically you could do that. That'd be a lot of work, though. Thanks, Brams. I might do it. It depends. <laughs> Fuck this level. I don't know why, there's like, invisible walls at the ceiling. Like that. There's ceiling here. It has to do something with the Suma Bros, I think. Fucking slowed down to try to get over the pipe, and then I fucked it up anyway. I am a super player. Just look at that. We made a bunch of fun levels, hard levels, easy levels. Let's make a stupid, ridiculously flooded level that nobody will love. Exactly. When the lightning from the Superman Brothers lands, it like wraps around and puts the floor on the ceiling. That's weird. <laughs> I mean, I totally believe you. Because that makes sense. Maybe? Okay, or maybe you're just talking out of your ass. <laughs> How long do I think the Super Mario World 2 to Super Mario World Tennis will take? Well, I don't know. I. <laughs> It was an idea, I don't think- I'm not actually gonna do it. Thank you, Dude Nugget, 2000 for the follow. It shouldn't be that hard, Max, because there's already, like, a setup for dumping a ROM image into the game, like Super Mario Brothers. So all you do is instead of feeding it Super Mario Brothers, you just feed it Super Mario World 2. But then, I don't know how long, since the same is not true for Yoshi's Island. That would probably take some work to figure out. Dude, nice clouds. Can't fucking get fast fly. There we go. That's not even fast fly. Shit. Well, fuck. I got a 362. It's terrible. So. Nice, Rez. 250? Time to do a 250 exit race. Three followers since you stopped streaming. That's weird. Like, were you there when I said, like, when we were racing, I got followers and I, I use OBS to record? And, like, the follower notification is still active. Like, I get followers all the time. I'm like, what? Snake, Pong were easy because they were little tiny, little tiny, like, mini programs. Super Mario Brothers was, like, 
hard but easy because a Super Mario Brothers like an NES ROM is a lot smaller than a Super Nintendo ROM. So you can kind of fit them in between, but like to fit a giant Super Nintendo game into another Super Nintendo game, I have a feeling there's going to be some problems with that. What do you mean 250 exit wouldn't make sense? Shell. 254, I'll take it. More gold. Secret exit. Yeah, it'd be nice. Another cape. Fuck. Yeah, it'd be nice. A cape. I jinxed myself. Small strats. Fuck. God damn it. Well, losing time here for sure. It's on all three files. That would take a lot. That's 300, though. It's a better which one. <laughs> fucking got the clip and then I died. Trying it again. Nope. Ooh, okay. Let's just wait. I'm gonna grab this. I almost thought I fucked myself because I didn't grab those coins and I was like, oh wait. <laughs> Does this level have a cape? Does this level have any power ups at all? Other than a star? Trying to be cool. Let's get a cape here. doing get this guy what am I doing yeah that's a good question bubble bobble get hype for bubble bobble all right secret I also practiced this level. I know what I'm doing now. It's pretty cool. Wow. 
Jayron, the problem with that is like one of the exits is extremely difficult. <laughs> so out of the 100 exits, 96 are like easy. Two of them are easy involving the orb. One of them's difficult, involves fucking getting the secret exit and funky. And then one's ridiculously difficult. Wow. Getting the normal exit in Yoshi's house. The clip onto the pipe, you mean, Bruno? I always clip onto the pipe like that, even when I'm not even near the pipe. Like, not even near the halfway point of the pipe. It still clips onto it for some reason. You can orb top secret area, but it doesn't count as an exit. Hey, Switch. Speaking of Switch, or not speaking of Switch, speaking of normal house Yoshi's exit, Switch, have you done that yet? Yeah. So, in the Yoshi's House one, you basically eat the berries. There's seven berries, but you have to glitch them in a way that you can- you eat, like, ten of them. Like, you pretty much, like, duplicate them with Yoshi. And you get Yoshi to lay an egg that has a mushroom. Item swap the mushroom with the orb, and you collect the orb. Because if you just collect the orb where it, like, spits out normally, you'll hit the edge of the screen and exit the level before you can actually finish it. There is a RTA route for it, but it's like ridiculously hard. <laughs> Exit. Did I say that? Oops. You haven't gotten yet, Switch. Well, that means I can still beat you. <laughs> Even though I haven't tried it yet. Funky Secret Exit is strange. I know, and it's amazing. It's so fun. There's like one difficult part to it, that's it. And that's duplicating the Yoshi block and licking the shell. You're watching through the power of mobile data. So I found out something, guys, in the Resnor fight. You cannot stand on a platform when there's a bwee, bwee on it. <laughs> like, if you try to jump on it, like if you're invincible or whatever, and you try to jump on it, you'll just fall right through. Oh shit, I just saved a decent amount of time. A lot of time, holy shit. Sunken Ghost Ship Secret Exit. Oh, that would count too, wouldn't it? Because, like, the exit, the events are all fucked up around that area. I know there's, like, a gap or something. That would be hard. You, I guess you'd have to mess with the third room. I don't think you, you probably have no chances in the first or second room. Oh fuck. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Good thing there's a cape up here. The last level with an extra event that allows Yoshi. I see. Yeah, you'd have to do it in the third room and there's not much to work with there, just a bunch of Koopas. And like, a one little tiny platform. <laughs> what is this run right now? 
It is amazing, is what it is. Dude, I'm gonna have a I probably have like a sub 128 sub best and just watch. Oh, fuck, I almost hit that guy. That would have sucked. There are one ups. There are at the bottom. There are more secret, secret exits. Fast fly. They don't have sun timers. Yeah, that's right. Thank you, Brams, for the host. By the way, Brams, if you didn't... If you missed that, I just did that room with fire. And I fucked it. <laughs> I fucked up cake. Oh, shit. Fucked up the net room. God damn it. I was gonna point out, like, the one difficult jump with that. What am I doing? Uh, I hope I hit you. Okay. Yeah, so the difficult jump is... Let's see. You hit the on-off switch and then there are two bony beetles. You jump, o jump over the first bony beetle is easy. The second bony beetle, you have to like tap A like as little as you can and then hold it right after you tap it. So it's like, tap hold. You want like a really short, long jump, and not a high jump. It's not insanely annoying, it's just... not easy. You know I have to go for it. Oh. Fuck, I don't hit that pee lamp. Dude, if you get wings on the first try, it saves time because you don't have to wait for the, like, end level fanfare. And I think that was pretty good, actually. It, it probably would have tied because <laughs> with the uh, winged Yoshi, he falls really slow and it takes a while. And I didn't grab the wings right away. 
Does the shell have to be upside down? You have to cape swing it like I did. Makes it so much easier. Like, you don't have to, but it makes it like 500% easier. Blue Yoshi on Blue Switch. He falls faster, you stuck at your tongue, but you have the shell in your mouth that you need. So. <laughs> you have to grab a Koopa shell from somewhere and go down there. That was really good hard clips. Second try on both times. That's pretty good. No yump reset. Damn it. Dude, sometimes if I think if you press down for one frame, you don't like swim all the way down like you usually do. Like it's a mini swim. Apparently I got it for a charm of PB though. Normal exit. I have to remind myself of the exits in this world. Dude, that took me like 10 times to get fast fly. Secret exit. That's the further one, right? What will I do about splits when I switch to the better forest route? I will keep all the rest of my splits, but I'll just get rid of the forest ones. Second door first. Got it. Second door first, first door second. Yep. Thank you guys. <laughs> Goddamn no block. I'm not doing the better forest route. The better forest route takes you, like, you ditch Yoshi on both playthroughs of Forest 2. Why? <laughs> Every time. I don't understand that. Moon. I purposely skipped it. <laughs> Derpling, that's how it's coded into the game, but if you, like, think about it, 
you'd think the secret exit has a moon. Because it's a secret. Duh. That's, um... Donut Ghost House is also backwards. The normal exit is coded to go to a top secret area. Do it at the midway point. Don't fall into the Aaron hole. My consistency on flying on those platforms is terrible, so I'm not even going to bother. Yeah, that route's fast because you can grab the block, the turn bl or the throw block every time, instead of swimming with Yoshi, which is godly slow. Okay. Game makers don't know what secret means. <laughs> so we make up our own terms for it. And in the code, if you open it in Lunar Magic, you'll see that there's like a big boo covering the second door. So you're probably not supposed to see the second door because there's a big boo in the way. Therefore, it's a secret. Could I use Ace to make the palette so everything randomly change every frame? Probably. So you could make seizure mode. I don't know if you'd be able to do it on the spot though. I completely didn't split for that level. Hey pillow. How's it going? Jankiest flying ever. <laughs> We're in there. The big boo is the real secret. <laughs> you could do that, Rez. I have a highlight of a crash I got from Credit Warp stuff. That is pretty much exactly what you're talking about, Dirkling. <laughs> it, like, makes a bunch of static on the screen. Like, you know, old-school TV static. Except the static isn't just black and white, it's literally every color. Well, it's good I did that instead of hit the fireball because now I get to keep the cape. I totally got the wall clip there too, I could have jumped. Fuck. <laughs> RIP! Go back and get a cape.
Dude, I can't do the dive under the thing. <laughs> My consistency is like 10% on that. Rip a minute. You learned why Pi 106 is so weird? Why is Pi 106 so weird? Hey, well, at least I'm gonna have some time save on this run. Jesus Christ. It pushes the frame counter. Oh, that's fun. So it's literally a different result every 256 frames. Plus 54. Dude, I want to learn the fast cape in this level. That'd be fun. Isn't there a moon up here? Guess not. It's in one of the identically looking stages. Gotta do better. Dude, <laughs> you gotta be so funny if I beat that. Where are you, Mario? There you go. There's fucking pipe there. So you can't just fly as high as you can. So if you hit it on just the right frame, you can get secret exit stuff. That makes sense. Or go straight to controller registers. That's really cool, actually. Someone find a new credits warp strat. Uh, Pangea Panga found one that uses a coin instead of turn block particles. Uh, but that was a little while ago. Illuminati. That was cool. That wasn't a gold split, though. You and Mr. Cheese found a new credits warp in Red's chat? What is it? Dude, thanks for throwing the shell the correct direction. Oh my god, you, you gotta kill me. Two hours in his tassel. <laughs> what the hell is it? Dude, nice speed speed. Oh yeah, love that fast. Alright, hold on. Practice this in a while. That was a good save. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. 
I missed that last jump because I ran. I was too close to the edge of that. Too close to the edge of that slope. I saved it though. Requires perfect frame counter and controller input. Well. <laughs> What if you save state when you die and keep loading that state? Um, I don't know what you mean, Breezy Jason. at first, right? Okay. Whoa! I just saved 35 seconds! How'd you know, Rez? Gosh, why did you spawn back, you idiot? Spin jump your ass, goddamn. <laughs> This is the best level in the game. I have the best strat for this level. Look at me go. I'm on world record pace for individual level record. That room is just so retarded. This room, however, is good. And I'm fucking it up. Fucking it up. I'm still fucking it up. Okay, there's a green block then, so we're good. That was actually really bad. <laughs> Dude, three out of four Resnors have been nice to me. Aren't all rooms retarded? They don't have mines. I like how you think. Well, can't tell if I did good or not on that. I fucked it up. Hey, at least I didn't fuck this level up. 
like certain somebody who almost got a PB and didn't because of this level. Oh, hey, this is 17 seconds of time save because of the bonus game. I'm pretty sure I got the bonus game in this level. <laughs> Thanks, Rez. Or maybe it was this level, I don't know. I pressed right, damn it. Round invalidated. Rez, I wasn't talking about you. Why do you assume such things? Oh, I got it. Oh my god. Why'd I go for that? I've messed that up like the past three times I've tried it. Fucking wall clip. Fuck your shit. Whatever. I got across. It was dangerous, but it's a good time save. That's why I do it. <laughs> At least I'm not gonna die six times on Wendy. I only got hurt by her. <laughs> I was talking about author. Because he was like... 30 seconds ahead of his PB or something. He fucked up that level and then... He fucked up Wendy's Castle, I think. Yeah, Nick, it is stupid. I was just a little too early because the fireballs were coming in. I was rushing it. I can get cape right at the beginning of this level. <laughs> Cry every time. Alright, let's see me fuck up uh, despawning the boo ring because I have Yoshi. Like, you can't even make it through that gap when you have Yoshi. Like, I was walking on the ground, and I still got knocked off. Still didn't get it. It's okay. It's not as important when you have Yoshi because you can just do that. Get the secret exit? Well, show me how and I'll do it. As long as it doesn't require like five double tongue glitch <laughs> things in a row. Fuck. Alright, so I got fucked by these balls. <laughs> the spiked balls. <laughs> In, the, in one of the races, like, they were going faster than normal. <laughs> well. <laughs> so safe. <laughs> I, hey, I knew it as soon as I said it. Usually I don't, I don't catch on.
Why am I going this way? What? This isn't the way you're supposed to go. Dude! Break the shit! If I zip through that shit again, I'd be so pissed. Well, that was a retarded time loss. <laughs> there we go. Okay, that quote's definitely getting accepted. Dude, wow, the hell is this a gold split? What the hell? <laughs> oh my god. That was cool. That wasn't. Fuck you, Yoshi. Oh my gosh! Did you see that? That was on purpose. That was on purpose. Secret exit. I'm not going for the flight that I normally go for. Oh my gosh, well, <laughs> so much stuff to highlight, uh, that's not gonna make it- Oh fuck, I made it. What? Shit. Just gonna get the normal exit. Is there feather, or... Is there feather at the beginning, or is it a fire flower? Thank you, Evident Gamer and Breezy Jason, for the follow. Dude, I don't... You know what? Here. I know there's a feather in this level. I'll come back for that. You're kidding me. Alright, well, then I guess we just fly over this level. I still can't believe I got that wall jump. <laughs> uh, skip this, skip this. I have to skip all that shit. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> Platforms that are above the screen are close to the edge of the screen. I don't think they are. Why am I being retarded all of a sudden? <laughs> Give me this shit. Dude, I could have saved so much time if I had Blue Yoshi. Because I have a strap for this level. Blue Yoshi, that makes it really easy. <laughs> I should still split it, Larry. Well, I'm gonna do... Ghost House after Larry, though. What? Alright. Dude, <laughs> you like ate that Koopa. I don't even need Yoshi. Fuck that. Rip. 
really. Just fucking up all over the place now, aren't I? Second time grabbing this cape. <laughs> Hurry up, finish. You're running out of data. I'll try. Thanks, Wolfie. I'm not the only one with those emotes. They're kind of like global Super Mario World speedrunner emotes. Alright, I'm going down here. <laughs> I don't know if I was supposed to scroll left or right. I didn't even do it enough. <laughs> Dude, that timing. Screen scroll. It was great timing for her to appear. Larry, please. Scroll left. Okay. <laughs> I had no idea. I knew I had to scroll and I kind of just fucked it. Sandbar skip? Should I do it? This run's on a roll. I feel like I'd probably get it. If I tried, but I'm not going to. <laughs> Yeah, Darkling. It's pretty cool if you've seen uh, Nathan's video on Kamek. Kamek? Magic Koopa? Whatever. <laughs> I start to call her Kamek because that's what Aaron calls her, and it's funny. Losing a little overworld time, it's okay. Don't do sandbar. But I want to save so much time. Two feathers this time. I should have just had two feathers the entire time. I don't know why I grabbed a fire flower. Oh, I should have. Yeah, I don't know. I would have fucked up overworld events stuff. Yeah, Rez, I understand that. It's just that <laughs> it's kind of grown on me. The same reason why sometimes I pronounce your name Reezy, and sometimes I pronounce it Rez, and sometimes I pronounce it Rezzy, is because it depends on like who I'm watching, and what they say last is pretty much what I'm going to say. <laughs> I've died doing that skip. Alright, now don't fall in the res hole. Resi hole, resi hole, whatever. I made special care. 540. I don't remember how far we were ahead earlier. Reezy? Like Reese's Cup? Why'd I do that? Are you kidding me? Like, who does that? It's like, <laughs> let's jump into the ceiling. Dude, 
why didn't you die? Dude, I got four good resonors in this run. It's amazing. So we got, what, Michael, Nathan, and Nate? <laughs> or Nathan? Do I know cape kill? No! I know ball skip, though. But I suck at ball skip with the cape, so we'll see how that goes. In fact, I could probably just hurt myself. Dude, I'm gonna purposely hurt myself so I can get ball skip. <laughs> Is it terrible or what? PB hype, I know. Oh my god, it's gonna be a big giant PB too. message already. Thanks, Eric. Is it just going to be a bunch of blarg spam? I wouldn't be surprised. Okay, anybody, if you're going to spam, this is to the mods because, well, everybody, mods especially because you can actually play the sound effect. Um, go to Weebly's channel instead of this channel. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so that... This channel doesn't get spammed. It'll still come up in my chat. Or it'll still the sound will still appear in my stream. But if you go to the bots channel, it won't spam my chat. <laughs> 13410. <laughs> What's so funny is this would have bopped Brams like yesterday. <laughs> Such a good run, holy crap. Ending was kind of shaky, and then I fucked up Roy, but everything else, holy crap. <laughs> PB with the wall jump. <laughs> Thanks, Brams. Illuminati! <laughs> Hold on. Nice V. Thank you guys. <laughs> uh oh. Nice. Pog Champ Deluminati. <laughs> the odds of you reading this are infinitesimal. Poyo! Where's that uh, smiley emote that Pogio uses? I love that smiley face. Are you sure about that, Rez? <laughs> nice V again. <laughs> v! So much V. Is that one? It's got it. Got it! Spam is real. It's good spam, though. 
Where does that put me on leaderboards? Probably only bopped like one person. Seems to be how it goes. I have a 4 and 139. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. That puts me up 14 spaces. Nice. Hey, I beat Carl <laughs> by six seconds. Thanks, Brams. Thanks, everybody. I'm Bob to you again. I guess. Vortex doesn't have symbols? That's weird. Hey, gamer girl. <laughs> I, bo <laughs> I bopped your 207. Don't I have tied world record 0x with Carl? Well, okay, this is how it goes. I have a tied world record zero exit with Carl on console. Pangea Panga has the world record of 138 for zero exit, but it was done on emulator. So, I mean, it still counts as zero exit, and he should really have the world record, but some people don't like being an emulator. But, whatever. I count it. I say he has the record. Now you're top 30. I wonder where I would be. What even number am I? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 3, 2, 4, 2, 5, 2, 6, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38. That puts me in number 38. Is it normal for a 14 minute video to be about 1 gig? Uh, it depends on how it's compressed, and judging by that, I would say it's not compressed. Because, <laughs> like... My streams are like... Like, I record my streams locally. This one is 2 hours long, and it's 2 gigs. So... The codec that it's using and its compression is not optimal. Should have had his emulator on S video mode. Yeah, switch, that'd be pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, the only advantage emulator has is the pixels are like super good looking. But I mean, if you have good capture hardware, you can do that too, so. <laughs> we can race again, yes! That's right, Brams. We're only, like, three minutes off again. <laughs> it's funny. How much time did you cut off again from 136 to 131? That's, like, five minutes. I cut off five minutes. That's funny. <laughs> Thanks, Kisto. I did 96 faster and you did no Star World. <laughs> See you, Switch. Thanks for stopping by. Am I going to do it again? No, I'm tired. Well, I'm not actually tired, but I don't think I could beat that right now. Four and five minutes. So I'm getting closer, I guess. 96. Uh, what if that didn't say 96? Like, holy shit, I'd be so pissed. You know what I'm pissed about is, like, my splits are stupid and fucked. 